welcome back students to our online platform and that is our school's youtube channel today we will continue the science topic that is motion in the motion right now till now we have uh, we have discussed that when the object is in motion when the object is at rest afterwards the uniform motion non uniform motion scalar quantity vector quantity distance displacement speed velocity acceleration retardation at last yesterday we also discussed the three equations of motion there were three equations so one more state is there for the motion we used to call that state of free fall free fall as a name is fall means when the object is falling from any position when an object is falling from any position then it is moving under the influence of the earth's gravitational force only as you all know that earth attracts each and every object towards its center that's why we are able to walk sabko pata hai ki earth sari cheezon ko apni taraf attract karti hai so koi bhi object jab earth ki force of attraction jo earth ka hai uske under mein hi move kar raha hai then we are supposed to say that the object is moving under free fall wo free fall ki state mein hai the definition will be when the object is moving under Then the object is said to be under free fall. Now one more interesting thing is there for uh, this kind of motion. Earth, an object is moving under Earth's gravitational field. Earth applies a force. A force, how is it? Applied over there will uh, force will accelerate the object. Now, how much acceleration is there? We have uh, maybe you have heard regarding that small g. Acceleration yesterday I told you g small g is the acceleration produced in any object by the earth. Earth किसी object में जो acceleration produce करती है उसको हम small g कहते हैं। वो कैसे produce होगा जब कोई भी object earth की तरफ गिरेगा। गिरेगा means वो क्यों गिर रहा है due to earth's gravitational field. Earth's gravitational field means the acceleration due to gravity. कोई भी object गिर रहा है उसमें acceleration produce हो रहा है क्यों हो रहा है due to earth. That is known as g. The power, uh, the value of G, Earth's gravitation force is 9.8 meter per second square. Yesterday I told you the acceleration of acceleration also. So G is the acceleration due to gravity. Acceleration. Acceleration due to gravity. So this is the acceleration produced in all the objects which are falling towards the earth so the new concept is there if any two objects are falling from any height at the same time then they will reach the earth surface at the same time irrespective of their masses ab ne kya kiya ek chhota stone hai aur ek hamara bada stone 1 kg stone hai 5 kg stone उसको हमने सेम हाइट से एक साथ रिलीज किया रिलीज किया मीन दे विल हिट द अर्थ सरफेस एट द सेम टाइम इेस्पेक्टिव ऑफ दियर मास की एक जो ऑब्जेक्ट है वो भारी है एक ऑब्जेक्ट हल्का है उससे कोई भी फर्क पड़ने वाला नहीं है 
वो कितनी भी हाइट्स में ड्रॉप करेगा वो सेम टाइम लेंगे हम सरफेस पर पहुंचने के लिए व्हाई बिकॉज बोथ विल बी एक्सलोरेटेड बाय द सेम वैल्यू दैट इज 9.8 मीटर पर सेकंड स्क्वायर सो दिस इज अ न्यू थिंग फॉर अस दैट द टाइम टेकन बाय एनी ऑब्जेक्ट फ्रॉम अ सर्टेन हाइट ड्रॉप फ्रॉम अ सर्टेन हाइट टू आवर सरफेस इज इररेस्पेक्ट ऑफ देयर मासेस उनके मास को डिपेंड नहीं करता है वो कितना टाइम लेगा दैट इज सेम फॉर बोथ तो टाइम इसको डिपेंड करेगा दैट विल डिपेंड ऑन द हाइट किस हाइट से वो गिर रहा है दैट डिपेंड्स ऑन दैट नॉट ऑन द मास ऑफ द ऑब्जेक्ट एट द सेम टाइम yesterday i told you the equations of motion these were the equations of motion yesterday we discussed now for free fall for we can say for the motion and the gravity motion under gravity means acceleration will be replaced by g because here the acceleration is the difference what is acceleration produced in the car this and that when it starts from rest the condition will be different but when the object is in motion under gravity only then the acceleration will be the acceleration produced by the gravity only means that will be small g so the first equation will be the b is equal to u plus gt second we will use that in place of s it becomes h height h is equal to ut plus half gt plus third we have to g h equals to g square minus q square This, these are the equations of motion when the object is moving towards the earth when the object is moving away from the earth means if it is moving upside then this sign will become negative the value of g becomes negative because the, uh, the g is acting towards uh, in the downward direction when any object is moving in the upward direction then the value of g will be negative so the equation becomes v is equal to u minus gt Here h equals to u t minus half g t square. Here minus two g h equals to v square minus u square. That will be like that only. Maybe this is the new thing for you. So you are supposed to go through that seriously, and you should take in person that. And <coughs> tomorrow we will discuss the numericals related to these terms. What sort of we have discussed and the equations of motion and for the motion. Under gravity. At the same time, you are going to convey the message to your colleagues, to your friends, to your neighbors that if you are not subscribed the school's YouTube channel, you are supposed to subscribe now. And after subscribing, you are supposed to press the bell icon for the latest notification. At the same time, if you are getting any kind of homework, then you are supposed to complete that. You are supposed to take the pick of that. After taking the pick, you are supposed to upload on the school's WhatsApp number, and you should be careful because right now the what we can say we are we haven't got rid from the pandemic corona. So be careful. 
stay at home and be safe thank you thank you very much